on your WordPress dashboard. Hover your mouse over Niche Barn menu, then click Add Settings. This is the Add Settings page. The first field you'll see is the settings for Add Inside Post Content. Let me show its exact location on the site. This is the output for Add Inside Post Content. Now, replace the existing AdSense code with your own. Add size is 336 by 280 pixels so I'm going to replace it with the same ad size. This is not for AdSense only. Keep in mind that other network ads, like Inflinks, AdBright, and Shadowgla can be put here. You can position this ad, on either right side, or left side of the post content. This one is for ads below the post content. This is the output for ad below content. You may disable this ad if you want to. Position it on either right side, center, or left side of post content. Let's change the existing ad code. As you can see, it's just a matter of copy pasting. Let's move to the next setting. This ad code will show on top of archive pages. Let me show you where it appears. This is it. Change existing code with your own. Alright, let's move to the next setting. This ad code will be displayed below archive pages. Let me show where it will be displayed. This is the ad code's position. Feel free to choose its alignment. Now, let's change the Amazon Affiliate Info. Let's change the Amazon ID. This should be very easy. Type your Amazon keyword. If you have an A store URL, just copy paste the link here. Choose your preferred country. Let's change the Clickbank affiliate info. Again, this should be very easy to do. Replace the Clickbank ID with your own. Type your Clickbank keyword. Change this to your own CV Engine ID. You can enable or disable CB Engine contextual ads under Amazon Store. Let me show you how it is displayed on the site. This is the CB Engine contextual ads. Now, let's replace encoded Clickbank affiliate links to your own links. Let's start with step 1. Just click this link to open the Clickbank app link encoder. Enter your own Clickbank ID here. Enter the vendor nickname here. This is already provided under step 2. Copy this. Then paste it beside Vendor Nickname field. Simply click Encode button. Copy the newly encoded hop link. Now, just paste it here. Create your second encoded Clickbank affiliate link. Before going to the encoder page, copy the second vendor nickname. Click this to create a new hop link. Enter your Clickbank affiliate ID. Paste the second vendor nickname. Click encode button. Copy second hop link. Paste it beside affiliate link number 2. That's it. 
Easy peasy like eating candy. Let's review the already uploaded banner links. You can replace it if you want to. Make sure to click Save Changes button. Now, check your site. See if those ads are appearing properly. AdSense ads are working. That's our new ClickBank ID. You may go back to the ad settings page and edit other ad settings if needed. That's all. You can now start promoting your website. <laughs>